yesterday at this time. I was showing you that band of snow that was going by. Kohler picked up four and a half, so did Sheboygan, Plymouth 4.1. Most of this came after 9, 10 o'clock last night to our north, but to the south, uh, Milwaukee only picking up six tenths of an inch. That extended to all of our southern communities. Rain today, look at Watertown, six tenths of an inch there. West Bend, half an inch. Sullivan, half an inch. Burlington, half an inch. Milwaukee officially about four tenths of an inch. That wind advisory does continue until midnight tonight. That's for all of southeast in Wisconsin. Some of the peak ups we've seen so far 46 miles per hour in Milwaukee, 54 mile per hour gusts in Kenosha. Rain has been all afternoon. As we stop the radar for you, you'll see that we are still seeing a little bit of light snow as temperatures start to drop in areas around uh, West Bend, northern portions of Washington, Ozaki County, northeastern Dodge, and areas of Fond du Lac County. And we're just still going to see those clouds around through the night and through tomorrow uh, as another weather system pushes in our direction. We hit 49 today, but you can see the cooler temperatures to the west. They're slowly going to get in here. Look at our current temperature already down to 39, 38 in Racine, 38 Port Washington. Forget these two temperatures. They're having problems with the sensors right now in Lake Geneva and Burlington. So one low pushes out. It really intensifies. That's why we got the wind right now. And the second one starts to push in our direction. Lots of clouds tomorrow. Maybe a little bit of a rain snow mix in the afternoon and evening. And then leftover light snow or a wintry mix Thursday morning. Tonight, uh, most of the Rain snow that's around the area right now, very light, moves out of here by about 8 o'clock in the evening. It stays windy through midnight, low 23. For tomorrow, uh, we have a little bit of afternoon rain to a wintry mix. Flurries also to the north in the morning, 37. Then temperatures start to drop, 27 on Thursday. But again, a wintry mix in the morning could mix with just a little freezing rain. We'll be watching that carefully. Friday is the cold day, 18 degrees with a low of 8. And then we warm right back up on Saturday, 28 degrees with clouds and some light snow. Light snow or flurries also into Sunday, 33. And look at uh, Monday and Tuesday, temperatures back in the mid to upper 30s. Could see a little rain snow there also. Rod